Organic food, fresh or processed food produced by organic farming methods. Organic food is grown without the use of synthetic chemicals, such as human-made pesticides and fertilizers, and does not contain genetically modified organisms, GMOs. Organic foods include fresh produce, meats, and dairy products as well as processed foods such as crackers, drinks, and frozen meals. The market for organic food has grown significantly since the late 20th century, becoming a multi-billion dollar industry with distinct production, processing, distribution, and retail systems. Want to know more? Let's start now. Welcome everyone to my YouTube channel. So let's go. But before start don't forget to hit the like button and click subscribe and turn all notification on to watch all other amazing stories. So let's go. Policy. Although organic food production began as an alternative farming method outside the mainstream, it eventually became divided between two distinct paths. One, small-scale farms that may not be formally certified organic and thus depend on informed consumers who seek out local, fresh, organically grown foods. And, two, large-scale certified organic food, fresh and processed, that is typically transported large distances and is distributed through typical grocery store chains. If consumers know their local farmer and trust the farmer's production methods, they may not demand a certification label. On the other hand, organic food produced far away and shipped is more likely to require a certification label to promote consumer trust and to prevent fraud, which exemplifies how national certification regulations are most beneficial. A regulatory framework is most important when consumers and farmers are geographically separated, and such a framework is likely to cater to larger-scale producers who participate in a more industrial system. This regulatory approach does not necessarily match consumers' assumptions about organic food production, which typically include images of small family farms and the humane treatment of animals. In general, regulations surrounding organic food do not address more complex social concerns about family farms, farmworker wages, or farm size, and organic policy in some places does little to address animal welfare. Organic food policies were created largely to provide a certification system with specific rules regarding production methods, and only products that follow the guidelines are allowed to use the certified organic labels. In the United States, the Organic Foods Production Act of 1990 began the process of establishing enforceable rules to mandate how agricultural products are grown, sold, and labeled. The regulations concerning organic food and organic products are based on a national list of allowed and prohibited substances, which is a critical aspect of certified organic farming methods. The United States Department of Agriculture, USDA, regulates organic production through its National Organic Program, NOP, which serves to facilitate national and international marketing and sales of organically produced food and to assure consumers that USDA-certified organic products meet uniform standards. To this end, NOP established three specific labels for consumers on organic food products, 100% organic, organic, or made with organic, which signify that a product's ingredients are 100% at least 95% or 70% organic, respectively. Non-certified products cannot use the USDA organic seal, and violators face significant fines and penalties. Organic regulations vary by country, some of the most comprehensive rules being seen in Europe. Objectives of organic farming in the European Union, EU, include respecting nature's biological systems and establishing a sustainable management system using water, soil, and air responsibly, and adhering to animal welfare standards that meet species-specific behavioral needs. In addition, principles of organic production in the EU are based on designing and managing farms to promote ecological systems and on using natural resources within the farming system. These policy goals go far beyond a defined listing of prohibited materials in organic production. Society. Social concerns related to organic food include higher costs to consumers and geographic variations in demand. 
Organic food usually is more expensive for consumers than conventionally produced food because of its more labor-intensive methods, the costs of certification, and the decreased reliance on chemicals to prop up crop yields. This often translates into unequal access to organic food. Research indicates that greater wealth and education levels are correlated with organic food purchases. There are trends in some lower-income countries to produce certified organic crops solely for export to wealthier countries. This sometimes generates a situation in which the farmers themselves cannot afford to buy the organic foods they are producing. While this strategy may bring economic gain in the short term, it is a concern when farmers are forced out of producing food crops that feed their local communities, thus increasing food insecurity. And now we reach the end of the video. And thanks for watching. Out of this world.